What's happening in Las Vegas for the month of October? Well, that's what I'm talking about today, and I'm starting right now. Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. I'm Angela O'Hare a local realtor here in Las Vegas, Nevada with the O'Hare team. Thank you so much for joining me today. I try to get one of these type of videos out once a month, but I've been kind of busy and have not posted in a long time. But for October, November, and December, I will definitely be posting what type of events are happening in Las Vegas during the holiday season. There are so many events happening for the month of October in Las Vegas that I cannot go over every single one. Otherwise, it would be a very long video. I'm just gonna go over my top nine events that I feel you should not miss out on. The first event is the Shriners Hospital for Children Open or the FedEx Cup, which is located at TPC Summerlin. This event will be held from October 1st through the 6th. Enjoy PGA Tour Golf at its finest as many of the world's top golfers compete and earn FedEx Cup points in the Shriners Hospital for Children Open in Las Vegas, a professional charitable tournament benefiting its namesake. The tournament is the fourth event of the PGA Tour's FedEx Cup season. With a purse of $7 million, the event attracts some of the most recognized names in golf each year. Tiger Woods took on his inaugural PGA Tour in 1996. And just a little side note, I will be posting down in the description below all the information about each of these events that I'm going over today. Number two, Vegas Bike Fest. Right out to join the 19th annual Bike Fest in downtown Las Vegas from October 3rd through the 6th from 11 a.m. to 10 p.m. every night except for Sundays, which is from 11 a.m. to 4 p.m. Enjoy a weekend full of bikes, live music, great food, drinks, over 150 vendors, and whatever else happens in Vegas. The number three event is the Las Vegas Food and Wine Festival. The Las Vegas Food and Wine Festival is a celebration of senses featuring an eclectic selection of elegant fare from locally renowned celebrity chefs. Feast on an enormous array of delicious foods, invigorate yourself with sensational spirits, and enjoy the good life against the backdrop of this truly inspired event. This outdoor event unfolds for three nights from October 4th through the 6th, starting at 9 p.m. each night. And it is located at the Tivoli Village. And the number four event is the Las Vegas Pride Parade and Festival. The Downtown Las Vegas Event Center and Pride join forces to celebrate the diversity of Las Vegas' LGTBQ community. Join these festivities on October 11th from 5 p.m. to 1 a.m. for the annual Las Vegas Pride Night Parade and Saturday, October 12th from noon to 1 a.m. for the Las Vegas Pride Family Festival. This two-day celebration will feature a unique set of lively crafted events for people of all ages. The weekend's events will include over 100 vendors, assorted food and beverage options, pop-up drag shows, special appearances, and live entertainment. Number five, Springs Preserves Haunted Harvest. Spectacular fun for all ages awaits for those who dare to enter the Springs Preserve's annual Haunted Harvest on October 11th through 13th, or October 18th through the 20th, or October 25th through the 27th from 5 to 9 p.m. The family-friendly event features trick-or-treat candy stations to visit throughout the botanical garden, carnival games and prizes, a hay maze and petting zoo, craft and other interactive activities like entertainment, food vendors, and so much more fun. There are no reservations required, but it is recommended to purchase your tickets in advance, uh, especially the last weekend of October because it's right close to Halloween. And the number six event is Summerlin Festival of Arts. Summerlin Festival of Arts is celebrating its 24th year in 2019. This popular event features the works of more than 100 artists and craftspeople. 
Art enthusiasts enjoy fine arts and crafts in the inviting and festive outdoor atmosphere in downtown Summerlin. A walkable open air shopping, dining, and entertainment destination. Attendance is supposed to be estimated to over 40,000 people for the two days. The Summerlin Arts Festival will be held on October 12th through the 13th and each day from 10 a.m. to 5 p.m. And the number seven event is Motley Brews Downtown Brews Festival. The iconic Downtown Brew Festival returns to the Clark County Amphitheater on October 19th from 5 to 9 p.m. for the eighth year in a row. Join thousands of craft beer and music fans at one of the most celebrated local festivals of the year. Featuring over 65 attending breweries, 200 craft beers, culinary artists, and live music acts under the stars at one of Las Vegas' hidden grassy area. And obviously this event is for 21 and older. No one under 21 is allowed in this event. Number eight is Las Vegas Balloon Glow in North Las Vegas. The first ever Las Vegas Balloon Glow takes place from October 24th through the 27th at Craig Ranch Regional Park. Hot air balloons will glow each evening beginning at 5 p.m. if the weather permits it. And then there, there will also be tethered balloon rides as well if the weather permits. This event also features food vendors, retail vendors, and activities for the little ones. Tethered ride experiences where you take off and landing in a real hot air balloon can be booked in advance and start at $20 per person. At the actual event, cash rides will be available if the weather permits for $30 per person. And number nine, the last event happening that I'm focusing on is the Fremont Street Bar Crawl. Pumpkins are not the only thing getting smashed this Halloween in Las Vegas. Ditch the strip and join the real fun on Fremont Street for the Las Vegas Bar Crawl. This event is on October 24th through the 26th from 8 p.m. to 4 a.m. nightly. So what's included in this bar crawl? Visit up to five venues with express entry to all venues, no additional cover charges, drink specials at each venue, a personal party host to keep the party going, group photos of the night, prizes for the best costume, categories and prizes to be announced. Meet your party hosts at Mickey Fiends to check in. Las Vegas in itself is a great and exciting city, but on a holiday like Halloween, it's even better. The crazies come out at night. <laughs> Just like when you used to go down, uh, down in New Orleans and you walk the sh uh, French quarters. Oh gosh, the crazies come out at night. <laughs> uh, Halloween in Las Vegas is so much fun and it's actually a sight to see. Everyone walks the strip half drunk and dressed in costume. But some things to keep in mind if you're going into these hotels uh, or casinos is that they do not allow the masks, so you need to make sure you remove your masks before you enter into these um, venues. The weather is among the best in October. Um, it could be getting a little chilly because typically around October or the end of October when it's Halloween is when we actually start seeing um, the cold weather kicking in. So make sure that you dress accordingly. From the strip to downtown and all the other residential areas, there are plenty of haunted activities for everyone to enjoy. I hope you've enjoyed this monthly recap of what type of events are happening in Las Vegas for the month of October. Again, there are so many events happening that I could not go over everything. I just wanted to highlight what I felt um, was the most important that you shouldn't miss out on. As always, if you like this video, be sure to hit the thumbs up button, leave a comment down below, share with a friend, and consider subscribing to my channel if you're interested in learning everything and anything about the Las Vegas area. Thank you so much for watching today. I'll see you guys on the next one.